Hello people, today I want to be showing you guys how to get any game off of Scratch, if it's your game or anybody else's game, into an HTML uh, file just like this. So I just made a shooter game test really quick. So yeah, this is fully HTML, you go in a file explorer, you click on it, and um, this pops up. So this is... Load, there we go. Um, that is very loud. Hopefully, I turn down the volume in the video so I spare your guys' ears. But, um, yeah, it's pretty nice. You can reload, shoot, and everything. Uh, there are some things which are annoying, like the wait times between when you try and shoot is a bit, um, annoying and it, i think that will be annoying for some platformers if you try add weights between jumps i don't know but it's pretty cool it it does the job and uh yeah so this is how you do it okay so say i wanted to do this game here it's definitely not finished as you guys can probably tell but so after that you're gonna go over to this website i'll put the link in the description and um it's called Turbo Warp Packager. Basically, just packages it in however you want. So, I'll load up my file really quick. After you load up your file, it should say like the name here. And then there's a lot of options you can choose. I'll show you guys what I usually do. You can uh, turn on Turbo Mode if you want it to sort of look cool, I guess. Uh, you can turn on the frame rate, it does make it a little laggy. And then if you have a little pen in your uh, thing, you can choose high quality pen. I did choose that for my 3D game, um, so it makes it look a little bit better. Infinite clones, remove fencing, and all of these things you can tweak. Um, there's a username thingy. Uh, I don't know, you can choose whatever you want. But... Uh, there's close windows when project stops or close window I mean there's I don't I don't take that usually there's the stage size just usually you should just keep it as how it is and there's a lot of stuff you can change the rest is quite um, simple but basically just choose uh, I usually choose this one this is what it means if you click on this it should load up it basically means it makes animations and projects appear smoother so i have a i have a paddle game so i'm actually going to use that and then you can just look at these and what they are like um but you can change it scratcher that's what I'm going to choose. So, um, here this is going to be the page title. I'm just going to choose Pedro Game. I made multiple copies because um, I needed to change some stuff. But, you can choose an icon. You can choose a loading screen text. So, I'm just going to choose loading. And then you can choose a loading screen image. And then you can read through these and do it. And then all this other stuff. Um, I'll you guys can do it on your own until like cloud variables and I'll and I'll uh, fill in this stuff and then get back to you guys and then we can talk about this other stuff. All right, I'm back. I filled these in. Um, I chose my settings, all this stuff. And if you want to connect to cloud variables, just basically leave this on. Uh, it, it should be good. Um, Probably don't want to change these, literally what it says. So just leave it. It's just some like extensions and stuff. Um, and then I choose HTML here. And then you can do preview so it shows you what it's going to look like. Yeah, that was weird. Um, definitely not what I wanted. So yeah, it's, it's quite annoying. You have to keep tweaking settings and stuff. Um, like, I'll see if I take this off. 
if it'll work or not. It's weird. But after some tweaking, it should work. I'm not bothered to do that right now. But guys, trust me, it works. That gun game, it took me about like 10 minutes of tweaking. Um, like, it's mostly the runtime options that you have to tweak. Basically, those are like the main ones. But once you're done, you're just going to press package, and then you should uh, have it, and you can use it. Please subscribe, like the video, leave a comment, uh, join my Discord in the description. Um, and yeah, the link will be in the description for this too. And bye, guys.